Hey everyone, uh, welcome to a short presentation. We're from TU Dublin Students' Union. There's a few officers here today to chat to you. Um, you're very welcome to TU Dublin. Congratulations on getting a place uh, to study on the Blanchetown campus. Um, it's a really big achievement. So we're here from the Students' Union to just talk you through our roles, um, how you can get involved and what our plans are for this year. And um, so I'm going to introduce myself and the rest of the team will introduce themselves too. Um, so my name is Rebecca. I'm the president of the Students' Union. So we've all ran for election and we've run, won our elections to represent you. So I represent all 29,000 students here in TU Dublin um, as a student union and I'm the chief spokesperson of the union. And I manage that big team right there, all the pictures you see, that's a big team of 10 full-time officers uh, plus some part-time officers as well. Um, so I can't wait to meet you all uh, at some point in the year and I'll pass you on to Luke. Hi everybody, hope you're enjoying your orientation so far. Uh, my name is Luke and I am the Deputy President for the Blanchetown campus and I also look after education out this way as well. Um, so yeah, basically I hope you're enjoying your orientation and I hope to see you really, really soon. Hi everybody, my name is Paul Keane or as a lot of people just call me Spud um, and I'm the Vice President for Welfare and Equality for the Blanchetown campus. Um, so I'll be looking after any of your welfare needs and any equality issues that you have. Please make sure you do come up and drop into the office and talk to me. And uh, I'll pass you over to Moya. Hi, I'm Moya. I'm the Deputy President for the City Campus. And that means I do what Luke does, but in the City Campus. But um, I like to bop up to Blanche every once in a while. So if you see me around, do reach out. I'm always willing to answer questions and just hang out. So it's great fun. So our role. So once you're a member of TU Dublin, you're automatically a member of TU Dublin SU. So we represent you. We represent you on all the highest boards in the college. We also represent you on a class level through our class reps and through student council and all those fun things that you get to hear about. So we fight to make sure you get a quality education experience. You're here for your education. So we're here to support you in that. We're stronger together, as cheesy as it sounds, but you know, we are. So. If you need anything, do reach out to us. Cool, so I'm gonna just uh, chat about education real quickly. Um, as said previously, your education is very important to us. We run campaigns to empower students. And some of those campaigns would have been the likes of don't drop out, drop in, uh, exam stress, run for rep. And they were just a few examples of what we did previously. Uh, we do try to keep students informed about what is happen happening academically and we do so by using our social medias and all student emails so definitely make sure to follow our social media um, at the end of this uh, presentation and if your time in TU Dublin and um, you have any academic issues remember we are here to help because we're for students by students. Totally. So one way that to ensure um, your representation in the Students' Union is to run for class rep. So every class needs a class representative, a student who runs for the role and gets elected by their class. So uh, nominations are going to open on the 5th of October and it's a really great way to get involved here in college life and to enhance your student experience here. So your class rep acts as the voice of your class and liaises with us in the union and the college to help solve issues, to gather feedback and to actually improve the um, experience overall. So this isn't something you're probably used to but it's a really important part of our network um, and ensures that the Students' Union can do their job because we need to hear from you locally on the ground so we can solve the issues that you encounter. If you're thinking of running for the position, you absolutely should. It's a wonderful opportunity. You get great training that's completely free and support throughout the year. It looks great on your CV and you get to be part of this wonderful network of the largest uh, group of class reps in the country. So as I said, nominations are gonna open on the 5th of October Keep an eye on your emails because nomination forms will be sent out that way. And um, so fill in the nomination form if you're interested and run for the position. You won't regret it. Yeah, and back to welfare. So we often run welfare campaigns as student welfare is one of our top priorities. Some of the welfare campaigns that we've run in the past have been the Be Safe, Be Sexy, Be Safe, Be Seen, Mental Health Week and Drug Harm Reduction Week. We run campaigns focusing on mental, physical and sexual health during the year. During the year, we offer training like consent training and asset training and lots more. It's important for us to know that you feel as though you be, belong and we try to foster a safe environment for everyone. 
Uh, we do this by working with the LGBTQ societies throughout the year. I'm working on policies for students like the gender expression policy, consent policies, and international protection applicant. Uh, consent is always important. And later you receive a talk on consent. I hope it's informative to you all and enjoy the talk. So advice. So as a student union, we offer a free, independent and confidential advice service. We offer info on accommodation. We help with exam issues. We help with referring on for mental health difficulties. We offer advice on financial matters like SUSE and applying for student assistance funds, because sometimes those can be awkward. So you can send us an email or whatever, anything. And then we also help with just any general queries. Um, so you can email us at our advice email, advice at uwsu.ie, or you can email any of your local um, SU reps. So like Luke or Spud, they're always, they always love a good email. So hit them up. So uh, representation, it's absolutely at the core of what we do and it's informed by ye, the students. We wouldn't be a union without you. Um, we are working for the past year on the organisational design of TU Dublin because there's going to be a new structure in place and we hope to have even further input and more of the student voice involved in this project for this year. Um, and we are really in, um, involved in the higher committees within TU Dublin too. So Academic Council is where all the decisions on academic matters are made. We have six seats on Academic Council and somewhere where we often speak up about student issues. We're also on governing body, which is uh, the highest decision making forum in the college. We've got two seats on that as well. Student Council is the highest decision making body in the college for us as well. And there are 101 seats on the council. The seats are made up of us, the full time officers, part time officers, school reps and student councillors. So they're all students. And they're, they're the ones that inform us on what we should do and spend our time doing as officers. It's also the forum in which we debate and vote on motions and policies. If you're interested in being a member of Student Council, you can get elected onto it in the first class rep meeting of the year, which will be held this semester. Class rep meetings happen twice a semester and they're where local class issues and facilities issues are discussed. All students are definitely welcome to come, but only class reps can vote in the meetings themselves. So, a, a bit of fun. Uh, your SU is really, uh, it's really important to us that you feel really welcome here. Um, and so we can't do things in person, but we have organized a huge um, array and range of online events for you um, that are gonna run from the 12th of October. So we've got a great welcome week um, and it's full of free online events. So we've got 15 events over the course of the week. So there's something in the mornings, afternoons and evenings. So each morning there's gonna be activity classes like yoga or HIIT classes. And then in the afternoon, there's something like my favourite event, which is um, a Dot and Conroy draw along, uh, our favourite artiste on the telly. Um, and then there's also events like climate justice, music bingo, knitting, little hats for babies in hospitals, so sweet, speed friending and virtual catchphrases. Again, all these are online and they're completely free. So it's like a key opportunity for you to make friends here. And on the 30th of September, we're also having a huge ball for online freshers which is again completely free. It's, in, it's being run in collaboration with loads of colleges around Dublin. Um, so make sure to check it out. For more information on any of these events um, we have during Welcome Week or during the year, you check out our social media or our website on tdublinsu.ie. So every year we raise money for charity and this year our RAG charity is the Irish Cancer Society. It's a very wordy charity and I hope you all get involved with a RAG fundraiser. We are running a Fighting for Cancer, Fighting Cancer Char Championship where student volunteers all raise money for a RAG charity with the support of our VP for events, Mark. There, there will be a leaderboard to keep track of how much students have raised, as well as lots of prizes. Our target this year is to raise over 20,000 euro. We're always looking for volunteers for events, so if you're interested in getting involved, please contact us. So things to come. So we've loads planned for the year, like Mental Health Week, we've Welcome Week, which was just discussed, we have sexual health campaigns, uh, we have exam support campaigns, we have Raising Giving or RAG, as Bud was just chatting about, and we also have the Vampire Cup and my all-time favourite, class rep elections. No, 
I love class recollections. Everyone makes them. They're the best. <laughs> cool. So our advice for this year is to get involved. Ask for support when you need it. And please join a club or society to find your tribe this year as well. They are free. And please remember that your SU is here for you when you need us. So don't hesitate to reach out. This year is going to be a little bit different, but you'll soon learn how much of a community we are in Blanchardstown. And I hope that you get to learn to love this place just as much as I have over the years. But we are here for you no matter what. So if you need us, reach out. All right, so this is the last slide and probably the most important one. Um, and it's where you can find us this year. So although you can see that we're all working from home and we've all got weird backdrops. Yes, that is a bed sheet behind me. Uh, we're all trying our very best, but we uh, are working all around the clock to make sure that you're fully supported this year. And your students union are here. Sometimes you can feel a bit lost, you can feel a bit lonely in a normal year. And this one is particularly difficult for you to go through. Um, and so just remember that you're not alone. You're part of this huge community and the student union are completely independent from the college. So we can support you no matter what and no matter what issues you are facing. And um, so this is uh, all the ways you can find us and contact us. Um, our social medias are there. All our tags are at TU Dublin SU. Um, our Twitter account is buzzing. Um, our Instagram is great and so is our Facebook. And there's local groups on Facebook too. So you can meet people from Blanchardstown as well. So join those. Um, our main hub is our website, tdublinsu.ie, where you can find all this information that we've already spoken about. And our key email is advice at tdublinsu.ie. There's no query too big or too small that can go to that email. So make sure to take a photo of this, um, of this screen, um, so you can keep it handy in case you come across something difficult this year. So thanks for listening to us. Um, it was a brief snapshot of what we got up to, but there's way more to come. And we can't wait to see y'all. Uh, so thank you so much. Bye. Bye. Woo! Bye. Bye.